Kevin from JJ Hat Center. How you doing? Uh, hey, we just talk about caps today. I um, work at the oldest, I'd like to say the best, uh, most famous hat shop around. We're here since 1911 on Fifth Avenue in Manhattan. Um, I'm here, this is going to be 25 years soon, uh, 24 years, 24 years I'm here. And I'm here to tell you about caps, two families of caps. Talking about dress caps, like flat caps and who's boy caps. I'm not talking about baseball caps, sports caps, golf caps, not that stuff. We're here to kind of get you out of baseball caps and give you something a little more grown up or you now. Anyway, two categories the Ivy cap and the newsboy cap. The newsboy has a button, generally eight sections, like a pie. You can see it here. It's the pie sections. It could be six piece, usually it's eight. The ivy cap is skinny, it's very narrow, it's a standard shape, most people wear that. It's a, also known as a driver's cap, driving cap, flat cap, cheese cutter, ivy cap, Kangol style cap. Um, there's a lot of names, every neighborhood had a different one. Now right now the big trend is skinny ivy caps. Everybody wants their caps to be skinnier, skinnier, skinnier. So if you bought a cap 5 or 10 or 15 or 20 years ago, they all all the ivies were wide and baggy, one width like this. That was standard. Now the ivy cap, people are complaining, I don't want all this stuff on the top. And it took them like five years for the companies to actually make this stuff, but now they make them skinny. Now, I'm not a good guy for a skinny cap. I got all this baggy, big puffy hair. So if you're a slim guy, well, you don't have to be slim actually. But you know, generally this is a, a slim kind of a cap. Now, I'm gonna say most people are gonna go for ivies. You gotta get the right width for your face. Just don't go narrow, 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 narrow. That's everybody's first instinct. You don't have to go this wide, but there are things in between. Like for instance, this is a really skinny ivy cap. I think it's like in the middle. These are by Stetson. This is a silk and cashmere. It's really like, Herringbone, but it's like lightweight. You could wear it in the spring, maybe even like the summer, the fall. It's kind of like an all-year-round lightweight. This is also a Stetson. This is a uh, really cool Belfast patchwork kind of thing. You know, it's like really high-end stuff. It's like a buck and a quarter, but you could wear it in the rain, the snow, and just yeah. You know. Okay, here's a good trick for, trick for cap wearers. Don't do this. Don't play with it. Don't make a crack in the bill. That's when they all die. So don't play with the bill that way. Set it, get your shape, and forget it. And if you want to fold it, fold the brim, the peak under, like that. Put it in your pocket, and that way you won't lose it in a taxi, a train. You pop up oh, in the middle of the night and get on your, you know, get off your train, and you leave it there, and you watch it go away. Everybody does that. So take your cap, take the peak. Fold it under and put it in your pocket. All right, let's go to newsboys. Newsboys are also getting skinnier now. The typical newsboy, okay, let's go over names for newsboy. Gatsby newsboy, eight piece cap, eight panel cap. Uh, what else do you call this? It's like the John Lennon cap. Gatsby, Applejack, Big Apple, Apple. So you've seen these before. 1940s, everybody wore these kind of baggy caps, Irish caps, Babe Ruth, Bill Cosby, Donny Hathaway, uh, the guy from ACDC, the, the singer, who wears it, uh, it's, it's a famous cap, a lot of people wear these newsboy caps. Um, newsboys were like this for years, this is an Irish, the Irish is pretty much the best, the top of the line, it's like a big sweater. And Jonathan Richards, like the Rolls Royce of, you know, caps and stuff. So you want something really thick, you go with that. You can wear it to the side, forward, back. Generally it's forward. It's great in rain and snow. You could even open this, put it over your ears when it's freezing. You just stick your ears inside there because the crown. I mean, these are really serious, warm, you know, Eskimo weather. Now that's... Like I said, it's traditional. If you go in today, you buy a, a, a newsboy cap, most people want something more like this. 
The Stetson type is more modern. It's a small one. They don't want all that puffiness, but they want it to be cool and, you know, medium size. Or narrow. Everything these days is narrower. Now, there's also something really huge called the Big Apple. It takes up the whole size of, the, like, the screen. Big Apple's a very rare one. Not that many people sell this. We do. JJ Hat Center has them. This is so big. It's like, the crown's like as big as my head. I mean, it's really, really big. Uh, you could do the Rasta crown thing, you know. But generally, it's just a bigger guy wears it, or somebody wants that real 40s. You know, you gotta break them in like crazy. All right, Big Apple's too much for me. Big Apple's a real cool one, though. Um, that's it, two families of caps. Newsboys are wider than Ivy's, and they both come narrow or wide. They generally come small, medium, large, extra, double X. If you go beyond that, buy Irish stuff, because the Irish double X is like a triple X. They run really big. I guess that's about it. Oh, it's a custom-made hat made by Van Wynn, JJ Hat Center. Um, I guess I designed it. He made the band, made the hat, and um, yeah, it's one of my newest ones. Anyway, Kevin from Metal JJ Hat Center.